Hello, in this video we're going to solve this exponential equation. We have 3 to the x cubed equals 9 to the x. Let's go ahead and solve this solution. So because we have a 3 here and a 9 here, one strategy we can use to solve this problem is to write both sides using the same base. So we're going to use the base of 3 because 3 squared is 9. So the first thing we'll do is just write this down again. So we have 3 to the x cubed is equal to, then here we have 9 to the x, so we can write the 9 as 3 squared, and this is to the x. All right, so at this point, um, we're just going to do some multiplication. We're going to keep this the same. So 3 to the x cubed is equal to, and then here you multiply, 2 times x is 2x. So this is 3 to the 2x. That's the rule for properties of exponents. That's how you work with that. So now we have the same base on both sides. We have a 3 here, and we have a 3 here. We have an equation. Whenever you have that, you can just drop the bases and set the exponents equal to each other. So this ends up being x cubed equals 2x. And so to solve this, what we'll do now is we'll set it equal to 0. So we'll subtract 2x from both sides. So we have x cubed minus 2x equals 0. So now we can factor out an x. We have x, x squared minus 2 equals 0. And you can check x times x squared is x cubed, x times 2 is 2x. We have a product equal to 0, so you can set each factor equal to 0. So we have x equals 0, or x squared minus 2 equals 0. So we have x equals 0, or we can add the 2 here, so we get x squared equals 2. This is pretty much done. And then to solve this, we can take the square root of both sides. Whenever we do that, because we're taking the square root of x squared, we do get a plus or minus. So you get x equals plus or minus the square root of 2. So we end up with three solutions to the exponential equation, which was this one here, 3 to the x cubed equals 9 to the x. The answers would be 0 and plus or minus the square root of 2. I hope this video has helped you learn some mathematics. Good luck.